Hello, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to run Facebook ads for digital products. Whether you're looking to run a Facebook ad for your online course, your ebook, or any digital product overall, I'll be showing you step by step how to do that. The first thing you will need to do is go onto facebook.com and you want to sign in. Once you have signed in, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option. And you are going to tap right where you see see all that is below gaming after you have done that what i want you to do is create a page for the digital product that you are planning to sell so you are going to tap right where you see page after you have done that you are going to be led to this page and you are going to add the name of the page so you can name it in the digital products name then you are going to add a category and you can also fill out the bio which will be optional so you don't have to do it but you can explain more what the product is about after you have done that i would also recommend that you add a profile pic and you can also add a background image to do this you'll need to go onto canva and from there all you will need to do is sign up you can sign up on canva for completely free all you'll need is your email address once you have signed up, you could type in Facebook and then from there you'll be able to tap on Facebook cover and you'll be able to create a beautiful background image. Once you have done that, you're going to go back into Facebook and again, I want you to go over to the left hand menu option, tap on see all once more. After you have done that, you're going to tap on add. After you have tapped on add, you will be redirected to this page and what i want you to do is go to the top left hand corner right where you see halloween costumes on my page you want to ensure that you have selected the page that you have created for that digital product once you have created the page and you have selected the page right there all you'll need to do now you are going to tap on create new ad after you have tapped on create new ad you will be redirected to this page. But before going any further, what I want you to do is go back onto Canva. And this time, once on Canva, I want you to type in Facebook again. And you are going to select Facebook app ad. After you have done that, you will be redirected to this page right here. And you will see numerous templates that you can choose from. And I want you to select one of these templates. The reason why I would recommend that you use Canva and the reason why I recommend that you use one of these ad templates is because you want it to come across as more professional and this in turn will help to improve your conversion, meaning that more persons will either purchase your course or your online offer or if you want them to for example sign up to a webinar or so on it is more likely that persons will do that as by placing a professional looking ad will help in turn build trust and also improve conversion as i said so let's say for example i would like to use this template all i would need to do is tap on it once i've tapped on it i will be redirected to this page and i will be able to see it better then all I'll need to do now is tap on customize this template. Once I've done that, I will be redirected to this dashboard. And from here, you'll be able to make any changes you want. So you could change the image right here if you want. By simply tapping on the image, then you could go over to the left hand menu option, tap on uploads, and you could upload an image of your digital product or you could upload an image of yourself. So, for example, if you are selling an ebook, you could simply add the ebook cover right here, and you can also change the text section. All you have to do is tap on each text box and you'll be able to edit it. You can edit practically anything on this platform. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on share in the top right hand corner. Then you are going to scroll down and you are going to tap on download. After you have tapped on download, you are going to tap on download again. Then you can see that it is being downloaded. And by the way, Facebook still has a major pull in the market. As you can see that on estimate, they get 16.8 billion views per month. 
and on average persons are staying on Facebook for at least 10 minutes and majority of their visitors are from tier 1 countries and by tier 1 countries I mean United States, Canada or the United Kingdom. You can see right there that majority of their viewers are from the United States. Now back to Facebook we'll go. So once you have downloaded the product, once you have downloaded the image of Canva better yet, all I want you to do now is go back onto this page as you can see right here. You would tap right there. Then from there you are going to tap on upload and you would add the image. By doing that you will change the image right here that we are going to be using for our ad. After doing that all you will need to do now is scroll down then you can add your headline right here and after you have done that you will have the call to action button so you can decide which call to action you want whether it is apply now, book now, contact us or download it all depends what you would like someone that visits or sees your ad to do as you can see that there are numerous options that you can choose from once you have selected the option that best suits you all you'll need to do now you can add your website URL right here and after adding your website URL you are going to scroll down then you can select the audience that you would like to target so you are going to tap on the pencil icon once you have tapped on the pencil icon you can decide whether you would like to target all genders or you would like to target only men or only women then you can also choose the age group that you would like to target right here after you have done that you can select the locations that you would like to target all you'll need to do is tap on the box then if you would like to target persons for example in the United Kingdom all you'll need to do is type in United Kingdom as you can see right here and you can even get more specific so if you like to target persons in only a certain area for example in only New York City or in only London overall you can do that with Facebook you can zone down the type of persons that you like to target also by scrolling down right where you see detail targeting so let's say for example you want to target persons that are pet lovers all you will need to do is simply tap right where you see detail targeting then from there you could type in pet then you can select pets, you could select pet food, you can also put in different type of dogs and different type of cats. So you'll be able to zone it down even better and by doing this you will improve your conversion rate. After you have done all of this all you'll need to do now is simply scroll down and you're going to tap on save audience. Once you have saved the audience all you'll need to do is scroll down a bit and then from there you can select the duration this means how long would you like your ad to run so you can see automatically they have selected seven days but you can choose when you'd like it to start and when you would like it to finish after choosing the start and end date you're going to select your budget and this means how much money are you willing to spend per day so you're going to tap right where you see the pencil then from there you can add the amount that you like to spend. So let's say for example I like to spend $20 per day on ads. All I'll need to do is type in $20. Then after doing that you can see right there the amount of reach that I'll get. Then you can select your placements. Would you like your ads to be run on Facebook, Instagram and Messenger? Or you, would, you, would you prefer it to be placed only on Facebook? If you want it to be run only on Facebook, you can simply untick Instagram and Messenger as you can see right there. And after you have done that, you are going to set up your payment method. Once you have set up your payment method, all you'll need to do now is tap on promote now. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.